12 to 12.45 p.m. lunch in three break rooms. When you register for this event, you were asked to select one, two, one of three different breakout sessions. We'll review those choices again now. You can choose to attend number one, brain game room, where participants can spectate or play along to Hey Robot, led by Frankie Bayak. Number two, Icebreakers and Networking Room, where you can socialize and network with icebreakers led by Aaron Smithers. Number three, there is also the Zen Room, where you can eat your lunch and listen to mellow music or participate in a guided meditation using food prompts led by Ashley Ritchie. We hope you enjoy the breakout session you choose, and we will see you back in the main ballroom at 12.45 for our exclusive dance class. So everybody is assigned. There's a few people that haven't joined yet. So we'll give it just one more minute and then we'll start up icebreakers and networking. So also, if you want to go grab something to drink, something to eat, a snack before we get started, you have time to do that as well. Feel free at any time during this breakout room to go use the restroom, get something to drink, get a snack, get something to eat. You know, uh, we still have two more hours of our luncheon, so we want to make sure everyone's hydrated and we have food in our bellies. So at any point during this, feel free to eat your lunch, get lunch, get something to drink, use the restroom, do, you know, do whatever you need to do. Would you like some soup? I just ask that if you're in a noisy area, because we are going to be talking, people are going to be answering questions that you just mute yourself until it's time mm -hmm. for you to talk. So everybody has the ability now to mute and unmute themselves. So there should be no, uh, no problems unmuting when you need to. Um, if, if I you have to go to the bathroom, try not to fall in. Yes. And uh, <laughs> <laughs> so it is possible. At least oh, oh, <laughs> if you, uh, also, if you have to use the restroom or go into another room, leave your computer and your phone where it is, right? <laughs> this is so funny. <laughs> All right, so guys, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be pulling up some uh, questions that everybody should be able to see. Can you see the whiteboard? Yeah. 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 All right, so yep. what I'm going to do is I have a giant list of icebreaker questions. I'm going to type a question, and then if we could, let's try to just talk one at a time. Um, um, might get a little hard because there are a lot of people in this room, but let's try it out. Okay. So here's the first question. Want to put some rice in it? What is your most used emoji? So if you mm. text a lot, if you use social media, uh, what emoji do you use the most? Hmm. I, I use a smiley face. Smiley face? That's a classic. Oh, I'm not using emoji on my computer. Okay, so Which emoji can you use most? Uh, the emoji on the computer, the smiley face. Smiley face. All right. Aaron. We've got Aaron. smiley faces. Aaron. Yeah. I use the hearts. The hearts emoji. Oh, I like that one. Yeah, I use the hearts to let people know 
that they're loved. Excellent. Is that Richard? Is that you? It says iPad. Uh, me. Oh, it's Andrew. I I I copy top. I do my face. I do top. Excellent. And Julia. I had to check my uh, little thing where you can look at what their frequently used emojis. And right, right. now, thanks to all the applause for the award winners, it's uh, the applause one, <laughs> but it, it, it changes from time to time. That's excellent. That's a very supportive emoji. I like, I like the, one. the Oh, sorry, go ahead. I like the hearts one. The heart? Yeah. I like the heart too. Do you guys use a red heart or do you use a colored heart? Because there's like purple, blue. I orange. use black. I use the red heart. The red hearts? I use the my Facebook kids. Oh. I like that one, Natalie. I use the red hearts when I use the hearts usually. Excellent. I always, uh, I think the one I use the most is the emoji of like the person going like, like, I don't know. <laughs> or sometimes I'll go and if it's somebody's birthday, I'll do the hearts and a birthday cake and that kind of stuff. Every time I say happy birthday to someone, there are four emojis I use. It's always the same four ones. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> uh, Unless I use a gift. Sometimes I don't want to do that, so I use a gift. All right, here's the next question. If you could bring, oh, that's not what that says. Hello, there we go. If you could bring back any fashion trend, what would it be? Bell bottoms. Bell bottoms? Mm -hmm. I love that. Oh, also, um, if you want to type your answers in the chat, I can see them as well. So feel free to just chat or you, you guys are doing a really good job at trying to not speak over each other. So this is working out really well. So Ellen, I saw you had your hand up. What fashion trend would you bring back? Poodle skirts. Oh, wait, that's fun. From the 1950s and 60s when people used to wear when they go out dancing. Yeah, with like those black and white shoes. Yeah. I like that. And with the little poodles all on the front of the skirts. I like that. With the with the uh with the with the top that matches. Oh, Corinne said leg warmers. Love <laughs> leg warmers. Gotta agree with you there. I love <laughs> leg warmers. I wear them all the time. <laughs> yeah. It's funny. I don't like socks, but I could wear leg warmers all the time. I love socks. I, both. I, I hate socks. I'll take the leg warmers any day of the week. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. Any other? I like, I like, I like I wearing. <laughs> Go ahead, Julia. I like wearing two different, two different socks at the same time. I used to do that a lot. If it was like a certain place, like a place where I there wouldn't, I was allowed, like a place that didn't have a say dress code. Um, but then I got really self-conscious because I thought my dad thought I was too weird and didn't like me much, so I stopped. <laughs> but when I met Ray, I started doing it again a little bit more. So, like, you mean you wear like four socks, or you wear no, I socks wear that are different. different unmatching socks, two uh, unmatching socks. Oh yeah, I think that's huh? still like uh, still in. I'm pretty sure that's like still a thing that you can do and not feel. Like it's not a trend. At least I still do it. So we're just gonna say it's still a fashion trend. <laughs> and else, I want bell bottoms. You too. You and Anita want bell bottoms. Yeah. <laughs> 
What else did we say? Bell Don't bottoms. Forget. Oh, poodle skirts. Yeah. Poodle skirts. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> Any other fashion trends you want to bring back? <laughs> uh, bunny triples? Oh, I like that. Do you have bunny slippers, Natalie? I have what it's called bunny triple socks. Yep. What about leggings? Luggage. No, oh, I think those are definitely still in. Someone tell me those are still in. Because I wear those all the time. Oh, 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 you don't know why. They're, they're comfortable. Oh, yeah. What about... Um, hmm. So, did you want any shredded cheese in there? No. no. All cheese. right. Mm. No rice? Joey Mix. Hi, are you muted? No. <laughs> Hi, Alice. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. I thought no, you were muted. Okay. Aaron, Liz, um, Liz just looked at flapper dresses. Oh. And thought those were kind of cool. Those are kind of cool. Hold on, let me add those in. Oh, man. Nice shirts. Mm -hmm. Yes. No. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so the you next question. Mr. Richard, okay? Mention it. You have your own late night talk show. Who do you invite as your first guest? Talk show. Oh, go ahead, Ellen. Barbara Toppins. <laughs> Joey, who would you invite? Well, I invite um, and, um I invite big group crowd and um and then uh, if uh, uh, Miss Beatrice Camp and um Joe Butler. I'm surprised he's on there. Oh, Joe right. Bunner and Miss hey. Beatrice Camp. Oh, oh, the one with the glasses? Mm -mm. Joe Bunner, did I spell that right, Joey? Yeah. Oh, Joe Bunner. Oh, him. Who's he? Joey Meeks. He's yeah. surprised he's yeah. nice. Yeah, he's from Miss Beatrice And also, I would, I would do Josephine, too. Aw. He's sweet. Barbara Coppins and Josephine. Or Bukopins and Joseph. Sorry, we sorry, and people talking. That's okay. Uh, Simon, who would you have on your late night talk show? Oh, um, I want to say Hillary Critton. Peter Griffin? No, Hillary Critton. The president, president woman. Oh. Hillary Clinton. Right? Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay. Liz is eating, but she said that she wishes Elvis to interview Elvis. Oh, wait, hold on one, one second. Can you say that again for Liz? Um, she has food in her mouth, but she wanted me to say that she wishes Elvis was alive because she would interview Elvis. Oh. Be like, and I don't know if Coralis is on here, <laughs> but I would suspect that chip and rob if you're on this room that that might be your answer too so <laughs> you can ask elvis yeah. where he's been hiding all this time Frank, Frank. Yeah. Frank. <laughs> julia um kamala harris or if she was alive helen keller but she's not so <laughs> you know what we'll say anyone oh Sorry, hold on one second, Anita. Jen, go ahead. I would do two people. My two friends from Cornerstone. My friend, um, Billy Smurlis. And my housemate, Susan D'Amico. Aw. Excellent. Anita, who would you have on? Question Bun. Excellent. Julia, you have someone else? Uh, I said oh, Frank Frifflam. Sorry, I, uh, I, I either forgot to unraise my hand 
Oh. Or I accidentally pressed something when I was responding to a direct message from James. <laughs> no worries. Uh, oh, yeah. Frank Thanks. Franklin. Joey, who? Frank Franklin. Frank Latham. Oh, uh, he would be a really interesting guest. Frank Latham? Yeah, he did. Frank Franklin. Yeah. I think he's in here. Frank, are you in here? Oh, no, he's not in here. Mm. I'll tell him when we go back to the main room. Okay. Aaron. Yes? I got another one. Go for it. Because remember, they did it. That is Donatelli. Uh -huh. Whoop. Mission camera maker. Excellent. And also, yeah, um, uh, Michael and uh, Michael and uh, his brother that was working with you guys. Excellent. And Michael, and Michael P. And Michael P. Oh, I got one, Aaron. Oh, go for it. Um, I would invite uh, Peter Burns. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Thank you. Evelyn, do you want to tell people who Peter Burns is? Yes, he, he 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 was on the NBN NBC News. All right. That's who he is. All right. I can't see your whole thing. Your whole I'm going to move it. I'm going to move it. Okay. Okay. So if a movie was made about your life, who would play you? What actor or actress would mm. play you? <laughs> the actress for me, the actress for me would be Emma Stone. Emma Stone? Yeah. The lady who played in um La La Land. Yeah. Anyone else? Demi Lohio. Natalie, can you say that again? Demi Lohio. Demi Lovato. Simon. Uh, one actor I like on Full House and my big bad Greek wedding is John Zemos. Oh, he's in a new show too, isn't he? Yeah, it's uh, base baseball on the Stony Place. He's on, it's called Big Shots. And that's on, I think it's on Paramount, I think. I think it's called Stony Place. No, there's a new a new movie out with him in it that's called uh, Big Shots. Ah, so I mean, he's still he's still around and acting, so he yeah. might do more than one thing too. I'm still getting him on my fan mail. My fan mail. Oh, cool, Susan. Yeah, Susan, who oh, would goodness. play you? Um, Susan, stop me. Who would play you? Go ahead. Um, oh, uh, Frozen. Oh, the uh, people from Frozen? Yes. You mean Elsa, right? Yes. Because he, she's the one doing a singing song. Excellent. Anyone okay. else? <laughs> Melissa McCarthy. Oh, I love her. She is so funny. Mm, I think, am I spelling that right? I'll be right back. I can't remember the name of the, pers of the person off the top of my head, so I'm going to stay on, but okay. also open a new window. Sure. Okay. Let me see if I can. J-Lo. J-Lo. J-Lo? Mm-hmm. Who's J-Lo? Oh. 
She's an actress. Jayla, Jennifer Lopez, she's trying to say. Jayla is short for Jennifer Lopez. Just trying to make more room here. Oh, Jen, go for it. Sorry. Um, Mary Poppins. Ah. Me and Fuse. Yeah. Julia, you got it. Yep. Her name Hello. is her name is Amy Garcia. Oh. And she plays <laughs> Ella on um, Lucifer, and she's just as weird as me. Only she's more scientifically gifted. She's a forensic oh. person on the show. Oh. Aaron, I I know one that should come back on the show. Who? Um, life goes on. That used to come on on Sunday. <laughs> Yep, light time comes on Sundays. Yeah, life goes, life goes on. Yep. Yeah, you come on Sundays. Simon, you have someone else? Yeah, I do. I only um the chat of the two. Um I can't do it now. Um Melissa T O A N A A R T. Can you say the last name again, Simon? J O J O A N H A R T. Ah, Melissa Joan Hart, Clarissa explains it all. Yeah. Oh. Excellent. Oh my God. I'm going to go into the chat. <laughs> okay. I, I didn't know that. All right. <laughs> oh, bless you. Next one. Let me make this a little bigger. <laughs> okay. Mm, good. Ham, turkey. Turkey, right? Oh, yes, boy. Oh. Sorry, Julia. I'll fix that. Well, yeah, I remember you left over from last night. <laughs> no problem. <laughs> oh. All right. So, next question. You have to sing karaoke. What mm. song do you pick? You raise your hand, Billy. Battery is high. It's just high. Go into the camera. Susan, what song would you pick? I just told you, remember? Frozen? Yes. Okay. Yeah. All right, go ahead. Because I had a movie want, of it. What? Um, yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right, Evelyn. Um, you sang to me by Mark Anthony. Ah. Oh, good one for her. Let it go. Uh, Evelyn, what song? Yeah, my You sang to me. <laughs> No, that's mine. All right, Julia. Gotta pick a word. Um, hold on, I just had it. Oh, well, my singing lessons were, my one on one singing lessons were singing God Help the Outcasts from the Hunchback of Notre Dame. So Ooh, if that was an option, because I know that you have to, you have choices, you're not allowed to pick just anything, Um, then I would probably do that. Cool. Simon. I want to say Awful Rainbow by Judy G A R G R G A R L P um who plays um Dory What is that from? What is the song called again? Um, all for the rainbow. Oh, from the Ooh, the rainbow, huh? Get the last one. From the Wizard of Oz. Yeah. Oh. Excellent. And Ellen. Coco Mel from the Beach Boys. 
My oh, favorite. That's a good one. Beach Boys. <laughs> We're down in Kokomo. And also, Wait. and also, Cherish from Cole McGang. Excellent. <laughs> Anita, do you have a song you would like to sing? Oh, yeah. yeah. More today than yesterday. I'm sorry, Anita, can you say that again? More, more today than yesterday. B E T. More today than yesterday. Who sings that? Just try to Hey. Yeah, I know the song. Mm -hmm. I love you more today than yesterday, but not as much as tomorrow. That song. <laughs> Who's, who sings that? <laughs> e E T. Oh, saxophone. Oh. Saxophone. <laughs> oh, he is going to raise your eyes. Or the rainbow. Viral staircase. Go ahead, Simon. My favorite things by the sound of music. Oh, oh my favorite uh, movie because it's Sue and Hughes. I feel like we have a lot of musical likers in here. We've got a lot of musicals named Frozen, yeah, Wizards of Oz, there you go. Of Music, Notre Dame, Notre Dame, Notre Dame. I think it's called Hunts Back, Notre Dame. Yeah. yeah, I can never <laughs> figure out how to say the last part either. <laughs> Excellent. You know the the real Hans Bag who died. Maybe one year we will have karaoke at the luncheon, and then I'm gonna bring this up. That's next week, boy. <laughs> <laughs> bring it up and be like, "All right, <laughs> Ellen, it's time for you to sing Cherish" by Cool and the Gang. <laughs> Well, there you go. Oh, yeah, um, I love musicals. <laughs> so do I. Mm -hmm. I love them all. All right. So let me make this a little bigger. Next question. What is your favorite sandwich? Mm -hmm. Oh, no. My oh, favorite sandwich. Natalie, what'd you say? Will teeth. Oh, classic. I like good cheese. Yeah, you do too? <laughs> okay. I, I, like right. the, I like worship music. Worship team. Worship music? Yes. Yeah, worship team music. Ah. Okay. That's a good one. I, I like, on I like here, the worship Joey. team music. Whoops. I like egg and cheese with um peppers. <laughs> World Cheese Sandwich Day on my national, according to my national day calendar, was actually on Monday. It was just recently. Oh, I didn't know that. Evelyn, you said egg and cheese with pepper? Yeah, with peppers. Peppers. Ooh, that makes sloppy doughs. Oh, sloppy doughs. Aaron, I got one. Oh. Uh, Andrew just said a song he wants to sing for karaoke. Let me just add that in, and then Ellen will go to your favorite. Oh, hi, Andrew. Oh. Yeah. Hey. Hey. Hi, hey. Simon. Is it okay if I say something really quickly? Cool. You want to sing it? Say something. There's um, mm. the it's about the messaging thing on the direct on the messaging thing. You can do a um a private message, or you can do one to everyone. But once you private send someone a private message or they send you a private message, mm -hmm. as soon as you write something else, it will just go directly to them. So you will, to that one person who you messaged last, I don't know how to make this make any sense, but- um, Yeah, I know that. But yeah, well, <laughs> I just wanted you guys to know that because I did um, private message someone a while ago, and I think they, um, they're they trying to say something to everyone, but it keeps only coming to me. Okay. So yeah, I've had that happen to me, too. In chat, you just say it to everyone. Yeah. All right, Ellen, what is your favorite sandwich? A roast beef special. 
What makes it special? <coughs> what makes it special is it has roast beef, Thousand Island, and coleslaw on Jewish rye bread. Oh, that kind of sounds like a a Reuben. I don't know anything about no, Reuben. no. That's my lawn. No. Lynn. And what Lynn. is your favorite sandwich, Liz? <laughs> I saw that. Favorite sandwich. <laughs> Bologna, tea. Bologna and cheese, okay. I didn't know that. Mm -hmm. Ah, my bologna. Ooh, tea, 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 tea. Tea. Honey, right. tea. If you did not have lunch yet, this might be making you hungry, so feel free. Oh, 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 my. <laughs> Ooh, I love meatballs. I also, I also like broccoli and cheese. Uh, broccoli and cheese sandwich. No, broccoli, broccoli and uh, chicken. Mm. That sounds good. Mixed Anita, together. Mixed Anita, together. you have a, a sandwich? Hammer What's cheese. your favorite sandwich, Anita? Ham and cheese. Oh, another classic. You guys. And turkey uh, and cheese. I think turkey this group and just, cheese. I think this group just really likes cheese. He's on all these. <laughs> I don't have a favorite now, but when I was in, I think like first or second grade, I went through a phase where I really loved, loved, like my mom would pack it in my lunch every day, a meatloaf sandwich. Oh. Mm -hmm. How about peanut butter, peanut butter and jelly? Peanut butter and jelly. Go ahead, Mark. Tuna fish. Oh, oh, tuna fish. Oh, one? turkey. That's two words. Turkey. Didn't you want to? I did. Oh, no, didn't you want to tell her we had new phones? No. We do this. I need one. You have. You guys got new phones? Yeah. Yeah. I LT. I do. Another Same classic. Here. And I love meatballs. Oh, meatballs. Meatball parm. Oh, yeah. Parm. That's even better. Oops. What? What you think? I don't lie, Andrew. Calvin. Add that on there. Meatball parm. Oh, Julia, that's fancy. Mm. Peanut butter and jelly crepe. What about, what about pastrami and cheese? Oh, pastrami and cheese. That's a New Jersey classic, right? Got to add that on. Yep. I hope I spell <laughs> He's making me hungry. I know. I know right? And cheese. All right. How about salmon? That's good for you. Ooh, I love that? salmon. Oh, yeah. Hey, Eve. Don't go to bad food making you hungry. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> I thought you never ate. I hear a lot of pills with you. Okay, next question. What is your favorite item that you bought this year? My new laptop that I'm using for the luncheon. That's Aaron. 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 Uh, Aaron. Uh, Aaron. Uh, Aaron. Your phone, new phone? Yeah, I yeah, think my new, new phone. I like it. It's an iPhone. My new, my new TV. Oh. Barb, did you have something you wanted to say? Take, oh my God, he's taking a shower. Um. I know I said it before. Um, um, Sam. About salmon, that's good. Salmon, that's right. Let me add that into the favorite sandwich. Yeah. That I said before, oh, yeah. Aaron. Yeah, that's right. Fish is good for them, though. Fish. Yeah, that's fish it is. Yeah, Chicken is good. Yeah, chicken, chicken is. Chicken is really good. We always buy chicken. Chicken is the yeah. best thing to have, too, it is. Someone has some background noise going on. Well, yeah, there's a guy outside right now mowing, so it's going to get loud. Okay. Mm -hmm. 
No, it doesn't have to be this year. What's the what's your favorite thing you ever bought? A cell phone. Oh. Ooh, uh, my TV. What is Comic-Con? Hmm? Your favorite thing you ever bought for your phone? No, is it, it is the same thing, but there. Black well, Scott. Another talking thing. Somebody yeah. comments on it. Erin, mm -hmm. um, Liz has her answer, I think. Go for it, Liz. Uh, I bought a Crash Scott. All of your different craft supplies? Yeah. All of it, the craft stuff in general. Oh, I feel you on that. I uh, love my craft supplies. Um, Aaron, through the through the I'm part of my condominium. Oh. oh. Ooh. Condominium. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> Thanks, Gary. Aaron, my VCR DVD player. Oh. <clears throat> Go for it, Julia. Hi. Um, this isn't really my the best thing I ever got. This is the thing I love I remember loving the most. Um I think a little over a year ago. I had to pre-order it and it took months for it to come from giantmicrobes.com. But if you can see it, I have it with me. Mm -hmm. Um this is my stuffed coronavirus. <laughs> um, a few <laughs> proteins were attacked yeah. by yeah. a dog. Yeah. But this is my stuffed coronavirus. <gasps> Excellent. What? Yep. All right. So, guys, that is uh, that is it. Thanks for joining me. In, mm -hmm. uh, uh, well, Ashley's going to close all the rooms. Thanks for Oh, and I me. collect these things too, by the way. I have a nice collection. Thank you, Erin. Right. Thank you. Thanks Thank for coming, Erin. Thank you, Erin. You're welcome. So you can click the leave break room button, or you can just wait and it'll close.